idea. He's lost in the music. Turns out he didn't take ecstasy. He took my dad's dick pills. <laughs> I hate it when that happens. Right? Dude, you should work that into your act, man. Wait, wait, yeah. You're stand up? Yeah, yeah. Paul's the funniest guy I know. Yeah? Go tell us the joke. Yeah, tell us the joke. I usually tell, you know, that, I usually do that on stage or with the audience. It's, it's a context thing. I don't tell jokes really. Yet. Well, I mean, we hung out at this after party with Chris Rock. It was amazing. It was just a couple of us oh, and yeah. telling jokes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's Chris Rock. Like, when you're in that pantheon with like Richard Pryor and George Carlin and Steve Martin, like you can do anything. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hear me out here. All right? What if you come on tour with me? Oh. What, that's like a groupie? Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, no offense. No, we're not groupies. Seriously? Seriously? No, I know. That's no. what I'm saying. No, no, not, like a, not like a groupie. No, you guys are not groupies. Not. <laughs> no, as my opening act, man. What are you doing for the next few weeks? You want me to open up for your band? Oh, if you don't want to do it, my cousin actually knows Hannibal Burris. The perfect oh, for you. I didn't say I don't want to do it. I'm just saying, you know, just, just give me a second to think about it. You know? <laughs> don't think about it for too long, you know? All right, ready? Here's yeah. to comedy before folk rock.